people not laughing at your goals, your goals are too fucking small. If I hurt your feelings, I'm going to do it with pure intention. I love you, but I love you. Bust the 
What's up, YouTube fam? It's your girl, Trees, back with another video. If you are new here, I'm Trees. This is the fam. To be part of the fam, all you gotta do is hit that subscribe button below. You can comment, like, if you, and share if you like. Uh, but I do ask that you do, because it helps your girl out as a new... Uh, I'm not really new to the YouTube, but I'm new to trying to become that content creator. Trying to live out my dreams, baby. I'm, I'm trying to live out my motherfucking dreams. You can't live out your dreams if you don't fucking get started. So, this is my journey. If you want to follow along, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you're thinking about becoming a YouTube content creator and you want to shit, see what the fuck I'm doing and see if it helps you like I do other people, hit that subscribe button. If you have questions in regards to certain shit to start up, hit the subscribe button. That's all I'm saying. So, as y'all saw in the beginning, my little morning routine, uh, for the most part, my son sleeps with me. Um... Get up, get myself ready, clean up, make my coffee, get my kids ready. But of course, but of course, I did not record the whole single thing because, bitch, if I record the entire thing, my kids would be late to school. It takes effort to fucking make a YouTube video with the effects of walking up the stairs, walking down the stairs, and all that shit. So, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. So, yeah. So, let's keep going. Um, I'm all over the place in my mind right now. So... <laughs> we're gonna edit this part out and then keep going right now the only thing i have left to do is take my vitamins and i got all three of my kids out to school but here's the fucking kicker today's a half a day today's a half a day how the fuck did school just start and y'all already giving them a half a day and a three-day weekend a half a day and a three-day weekend it's 8 48 right now my two other one kid it's a full day the high schooler she has a full day the middle school of the bus bringer home is my youngest, which is my son. I have to pick him up by 11.50. So I got to get this to the gill done and out. Not me dropping a pill. So before I get started, I'm going to go ahead and take my vitamins because I don't care. I don't care. Every motherfucker needs to be on a vitamin. I don't care. Everybody want to, you can put vitamins. You can, oh, bitch, bye. I'm 30 something years old. Shit don't function right. I have GERD. I have a hernia from my son. Uh, so I take a uh, omeprazole. No, that ain't it. I take a fucking omeprazole. I take a, a multivitamin for women that got B12 and all that good stuff. And then I take a vitamin D 5,000 units because, bitch, bitch. My knees is going out. Like, my right knee, I got an accident way back yonder. But that motherfucking right knee haven't been right since. I got one good knee. And that motherfucker is used for prayer. Do you hear me? That one good knee is used for prayer. So, we're going to go ahead. I take our three, man, because I'm a G. This throat game strong. So, what we got planned today is, y'all see them shells that them girlies be when they on their YouTube channel and stuff? They be in their closet, though. I don't have a big closet. I'm not there yet. I have a, a house, a decent-sized house, but I don't have a closet like that. I do have a walk-in, but it need, it ain't that walk-in. So, what I plan on doing today is your girl ordered some shells from Amazon. We're going to put some shells up. Being, being out here doing woman shit, we're going to put some shells up. And then I don't know what I want to put on it, whether I want to put purses on it or books. I don't know. But I have a spot upstairs where I record and I want the background where I record to look really nice, to look presentable. Because for y'all that's new to YouTube, thumbnails is what gets you the click. Thumbnails is what gets you the click. And then today I ordered me some hair also from Amazon. This bob, it gotta go. I'm gonna do myself a quick weave. Yes, bitch, I said a fucking quick weave. People still wear quick weaves. But first, let me show you what I have on. Cause y'all seem to like shit like that, I guess. Um, one, I have on my waist, um, snatcher, whatever it's called. Because my waist is already pretty small. But this helped me keep myself from, it helped me gain it helped me strengthen my abdomen muscle. Like I told you, I have a hernia, so I'm used to letting my stomach hang out instead of tightening my muscles and stuff. So that's what I got that on for. I wasn't trying to camouflage this, as y'all can see. That the um, You can see the lines through my little tank. I really don't care. 
I'm honest. I'm not gonna act like my shit flat. And I'm not getting surgery. You see motherfuckers dying getting surgery? Yeah, I'm not trying to die, sis. I'm not trying to die. So this is the outfit of the day. I have these cargo pants from Charlotte Rules. I just don't like this part. It's a little, it looked like a pouch. I have just a regular tank top on from uh, Target. And then I have J's on the feet. This is the outfit that I am wearing for today. Just to do some in-house bullshit and then pick up my kids. Cause when I pick up my kids, I do like to look like somebody. And I'm so ready to get rid of this bob. The bob was bobbing, the bob was fun, but it's time for her to go. So let me show y'all what we about to put together. And then y'all gotta help me put the shit together the fucking right way. And we gonna see how this work out. All right, um, so I'm trying to see, can you really see me in this angle, but we are gonna work with it. I did, let me show y'all the hair. So the hair that I got, my daughter has this hair. I installed it in her hair and that shit is bomb as hell. Like of Amazon. So your girl is putting in a quick weave, three bundles, Brazilian body wave, 24, 28, 26. Girls, I'm about to be, I'm about to be out here. I'm about to act brand new. I'm about to act brand new, I am, I am. So I got that, uh, the shells that we are putting up today. I didn't even fucking open it. I opened a box because my daughter had a, a cell phone case in there or what have you. But I had this in my house since Wednesday. I didn't open it. It's supposed to be black shells with white uh, brackets or some shit like that. I didn't want to get white shells because all the girlies have white shells. And then my bed is black. Like my bed is black. And then um, this, it, I'm trying to get this stand, not the stand. I'm trying to get this, what you call it? That sits in the front of your board, it's in front of your bed. It's like a couch, but it's not a couch. Yeah, it's like a couch, but it's like, it's not a fucking couch. This hair, this, it's not given. So this is the color of the shells. It's just like a black color. And then they gave me screws. Now, your girl don't own tools, but what I did was, oh, oh, they give you this, but I don't think this is going to get me in a wall. So anyway, I was prepared to ban a drill. I bought this drill to help me with this shit. $8, $8. I didn't even know it was on sale. I saw that it was on sale for 17 and I'm a cheap motherfucker. So I said, okay, I'll get this for 17 But when I rang it up and it said $8, I had to go and read that I, I scanned the right shit. So when I read that I scanned the right shit, I said, that was a steal. That was a steal. But the only thing is, I think, yeah, it's a cord. So you don't charge it. Wait, do you? No. You don't charge it, but I got a extension cord. So we're going to go upstairs and we're going to install these shells. Because like I said, I only got a couple of... um. I only had a couple of hours before my kids get home from school and I'm trying to install some shit. I don't like, I don't like what my hair is giving right now on this camera. Anyway, anyway. So yeah, so we're going to go ahead and do that and then we're going to see how it looks. And then we're going to have this picture in the motherfucking thumbnail. So yeah. Invest in your dreams, baby. One thing you don't, you got to do and it's, it's invest in your dreams. It was some quotes. It was some quotes that I read before I started recording. And somebody out there need to hear these motherfucking quotes. Somebody out there want to do this and then two motherfuckers scared. The only impossible journey is the one you never begin. The only possible journey is the one you don't begin. If people are not laughing at your goals, your goals are too small. If people not laughing at your goals, your goals are too fucking small. Uh... One day you will wake up and there won't be any more time for you to do the things you always want to do. Did, did you hear me? One day you're going to wake up and want to do all the things you want to do and you ain't going to have fucking time. Because you're going to be 99 and old. And one more. People do not decide their future. They decide their habits. And their habits decide their future. Run it back. People do not decide their future. They decide their habits. And their habits decide their future. 
my habits is I want to record and put out three videos a week because let's be real I'm not a daily vlogger because one I'm a nurse I have to work that is my main source of income um I have to take my kids to school. The main thing is I have to work. That's my main source of income. I'm a nurse. So by the time I get home, I'm tired. I can't sit up there and put out a video. I hear if you're going to be a new YouTuber, the greatest thing for you to do is post a video daily. For those who have time, it could be 15, it could be 20, it could be 30 minutes. Me, I don't have that. But your girl did post an hour video. I won't do that shit again. I won't do that shit again because that shit took too long to edit. That one hour video was actually almost two hours. I narrowed it down to one. It takes too long to update, uh, upload, process. It, it, it was a month. It's a bit much. It's a bit much. This video may be 30. Give or take 40. So take those quotes that I spit out to you and apply that shit. Live your life. I'm 30 some years old. Three kids and a cat. And a cat. And I'm still going for it. So let's go install these motherfucking shelves. All right, yeah, so here's my room. So you see this desk. I usually do all my recording from this desk if I'm doing the sit down or talk about my hair as some makeup and shit. So this wall usually sits behind me and when you turn my um, light on, it's, it's very bright, but it's too plain. So this is where the shelves are going. So yeah, I just gotta map that shit out right. So let me find a way to sit you guys so y'all can see and we can figure it out. And then I'm gonna take this down. These are my kids accomplishment. I'm gonna put it somewhere else. So yeah, let's try to figure this shit out. Okay, so I took everything out the bag and this is how it's supposed to be set up, but it's other ways you could set it up. But I think I'm gonna go with this way. Like they have, let me show you my phone. They have other other ways you could set it up. That, that way look fucking retarded. I don't know if I like this one. I think this one, I think this will do. This one is gonna do so. I have to drill holes at the bottom with the short screws and then I think the long screws are for the wall. So let's start screwing these bitches at the bottom. Let's go. This is what it turned out like. I still have some work to do. I'm not putting this on the shelves. I'm just playing around with some shit. But let me tell y'all something that y'all probably didn't know. Or you probably did. How I made sure this shit was leveled. We have on the iPhone, we have um, the level level thing on our phone. Excuse the flow. Hold on. So we have like a level a level leveler on our phone so what i was doing while putting the phone down was i had the shelf i would put my phone on it to see if it was level like this one was level i think this one up here was a little off but i had this up see i'm off about one on here and it does look a little crooked but even up here i think this one's leveled i'm off by one but y'all i was fucking struggling like that shit's hard so now i'm trying to figure out what i want on here so i was thinking one of my louis vuitton boxes because i bought my first louis on my own for christmas for a louis vuitton wallet that i love so that is one option 
And then this part is the reason I chose this purse because when I was heavy on Instagram, this was my first uh, purse that was sent to me to promote. And I really loved it. Like, I wouldn't wear this purse involuntarily, but um, I would now. So I'm trying to play around with it. And then this was another purse that a brand sent me to promote when I was really heavy on Instagram. I'm not a purse junkie, so I don't know. And But at the same time, I am big at reading and practicing self-worth boundaries i have my devotions that i read every morning i have my books so i'm trying to figure it out y'all i don't know i'm trying to play around with it on what i really want because I, I don't want to be like everyone else you know so yeah let me finish playing around with it and then let me see how it look when i set you guys up all right but this is the shelves don't mind that over there. I still got to update that. I think I'm going to put like a big art piece there. So yeah, let's see. All right, so this is what I decided to go with temporary. Temporarily, whatever. Until, you know, my channel evolved. And then as it evolved, you'll see my accomplishment on the panel. So first one, I just put my Louis Vuitton box there that I purchased my Louis Vuitton wallet in the bag that um was gifted to me um to promote then on my second shelf of course i put god first with everything that i do so i always want to remind myself to pray meditate you know look above and depend on yahweh to guide me through my journey and then up here i got my uh inspirational books um help with you know growth your inner peace finding self atomic habits uh boundaries the un um another soul and then how to manifest i read all three i'm currently still reading this one right here still reading that one and then uh i have my other bag here uh that was my first bag that was gifted to me to promote and i really love that bag and i can wear that with a lot of nice things and then i have my chanel fragrance that i really love big ass bottle i had it for almost a year christmas because it was gifted to me on christmas so yeah this is what that looked like that right there i gotta get that nail out and then i gotta do some painting a little bit but i think it's okay so let's see how it look when i put you guys down okay i mean hmm. maybe i could have brought it down some see okay so when i hit play on the camera it zooms in just a tad bit but when it's not playing it zooms out yeah, it's a feature on the camera, but I am liking it. I'm trying to think, should I have pulled this one down some and then this one up here? No, because my head is going to be here and I'm putting something here. Not too much here. Maybe if I school. So you see what I mean? Like, okay, if I tilt the camera up, that's that. But it's giving y'all chest up moment. But if I and then sit my ass back. You know what it'll work it'll work i'm very pleased with this especially when you're ready about yourself because let me tell y'all something this shit was not easy <laughs> this shit was not fucking easy doing it with these nails i almost took my motherfucking nails off ladies anything that come in a box keep it don't throw it away i was not about to use this little ass screwdriver i was about to throw the shit away but then i realized in order to get it started and then hit you with the, the drill it worked out so anytime something come in the box keep it don't throw that shit away don't throw that shit away at all okay so yeah it was it was challenging but i feel proud of myself is it perfect no like this one is sitting up there but when i do things like um outfits or whatever i guess it'll show i don't know here i'm gonna keep this plain like i said i'm gonna take all this stuff down here and then i'm gonna do something on this wall I probably put like a big ass inspirational art piece up there on the wall. I'm not sure. But yeah, I'm liking it. I'm not mad at it. I still gotta get a nail out. I, it still work needs to be done, but I'm liking the process. Gotta invest in yourself, baby. You gotta invest in yourself. Because if you don't invest in yourself, who gonna invest in, you know, who gonna invest in you if you don't invest in yourself? Period. I'm all tongue tied, tongue twisted. I was fucking hot. I almost took this wig off. I almost took my clothes off. My titties look wide. I don't know why they look like that. They should look like this. My boobs just, they're they are boobing. My boobs are boobing. So yeah, I'm very pleased with it. I'm going to do a thumbnail. We're going to see what the thumbnail is given. 
we're gonna see what the thumbnail's giving i gotta do my hair and sis it is currently remember i told y'all my kids gotta have a day it is 10 43 i started this project at like 10 it's no way it should have took 43 minutes but it don't even matter i'm gonna uh i start editing the beginning of this vlog um i wanted to i wanted to um change my intro because my intro is not long enough for me i love my intro because it gives you a positive message but it's not it's not long enough for me so i'm just like still working on certain things i'm watching now on youtube my my one of my favorite youtubers kyra onique i'm watching her so i literally work at this fucking desk all day and this just helped me inspire like trees you can do this shit you could be the next um creator content that goes up this time next year i'm manifesting it this time next year speak words into existence that's more powerful than anything make habits if you can't record every day record or put out once a week twice a week my goal is every day this time next year i'll be doing youtube full time sure i've always done it and i've taken a break i stopped i get caught up in other things but like like i told y'all in the beginning of the video you can't your future is based off your fucking habits period like i am sitting here up uh, oh i am sitting here about to work i got my um my ipad that i bought and invested myself i'm watching youtube while i'm doing it i'm like this motivates me this motivates me me buying that and then i'm about to put this on when my kids get here so i can tune them the fuck out you feel me and like yeah just doing this shit it, it, it gets it done get it done people get it done get it done but yeah i'm very proud of myself <laughs> i did it i did that girl so y'all if you want to continue to like i said go with me on my journey as a new content creator well a revamp content creator and join me on my journey and see what i bought see what i do see my hiccup see my growth i'm gonna go from one view to two views i'm gonna get back up there i used to get like over a thousand views and then i fucking stopped and then when i stopped everybody went away which i don't blame them i would have went away too i would have been like bitch bye you stop posting you stop posting so but yeah if you got questions what have you i don't know if you just want to go on my journey and be like sis i've been there since day one because a lot of people want to see the progress because you know people don't wake up and become youtube celebrities or uh, content creators like that unless you're like jada or the real cause unless you're one of those instagram baddies i was one of those instagram baddies if you want i'll put my instagram name that i don't really use no more below and you can see i was one of those instagram baddies that's how i got certain shit or what have you um but i didn't want that to be my image if that makes sense if that makes sense my image is not just my ass and my tits and my ass and my tits so yeah um yeah if you want to join the fam again all you gotta do is hit that subscribe button thank you for being patient with me and watching my fuck ups too like i said everybody every youtuber that you watch they work they put in work they put in work to get what they get got and they put in work to get closets that they got like i said my closet i'm gonna revamp that but it's not my number one priority it's other shit in this house i need to revamp but yeah this was actually fun this was productive i could have slept all day because i gotta work this weekend but why would i do that i'm working on something i decide my future by my habits get into it get into it next time you see me this bob is not gonna be that this bob is not gonna be bobbing at all i'm gonna have the long inches for you girls okay all right, this is one. Oh, my titties are pissing me off. Look, they just so wide right now. I don't know. It's not the best bra. So yeah, I am out. I don't know. Bob is not Bob is not cooperating. I'm out. It's been fun. I thank you guys. I love you. Thank you for the one, two, three views I get. I thank God for every view that I get. I don't care if I'm at one, two. I know I'm gonna get back up there because I did it. I can do it again. All right, peace. Bye, guys.